Hello dude folks, Buzz here, Happy New Year to everyone and uh, I just want to show you this little Tesla coil that my daughter got me for Christmas <laughs> it's uh, it's uh, obviously uh, one of those Chinese made things and uh, it's come from a company called sterlingkits.com they're quite well known for doing sort of educational toys Tesla coils, uh, little internal combustion engines steam engines, that sort of thing so hop onto their website and have a look but uh, if you have not seen one of these before, they're quite good fun actually. I've been enjoying having a play with it. It uh, makes a bit of a row when it gets going, but uh, you can do some quite good fun stuff with it. So on here, you've got two settings. So that's the normal setting. And this one is uh, music. So if you get square wave music, which I've not really tried yet, you can, uh, via Bluetooth, send it to the machine and it'll convert that uh, square wave into pulses. Of the Tesla coil so I can't show you that because my phone's connected Bluetooth and I can't film at the same time but anyway I can show you this so basically we've got two settings power and frequency so we'll set it off on the lowest so as you can see you can get some uh, you get some nice effects on the on the low setting I'm not sure how my frame rate of my camera is coping with this so let's ramp up the power a bit. I don't know how well you can hear me now, it's getting a bit noisy. So I think looking at this video from this perspective, it looks like the frame rate of the camera is missing some of the pulses out. So let's up the frequency and see what happens. I moved back a bit, now you can hear them completely changing the audio for how loud it is. Turn the power down. So as you hear there, it's, uh, when it ramps up, it's really quite loud. And when you use the square wave of music, it gets even louder. It's uh, really quite impressive how loud it is. So you can use safe to touch this. It's uh, I don't know how many volts it is. It's a hell of a lot of volts, 25,000 I think, or something like that. But obviously the amps are very low. Now when it's on settings like low uh, frequency and power, you can touch it with your fingers, no problem. And you, I, you can barely even feel any heat. It's only when you turn the power up, you don't get an electric shock or such, but you can feel the heat of it when it pulses on the on your the point of contact. So there, I can just start to feel it. You can feel it warming up, and then it gets a little bit hot, and then you have to move your finger. Anyway, there you go folks, that's the bunker toy. Not really sure what I'm going to do with it, but it's good fun messing about with it. So yeah, sterlingkits.com. They seem to have a good reputation. Shipping was fast. I'm not affiliated with them at all or get anything free off of them, but uh, that's where this one came from. Cheers guys, enjoy. See ya.